Okay guys, so there's a lot of oil leaks so we started cleaning everything. I'm just literally using a, a cleaner, degreaser, and just a toothbrush to get everywhere here. Because we will be taking these off. I need to take this wet pan out. Get it all done. Somebody added a lot of RTV um, in here. I don't know if they, it looks like they did change the gasket, but they did add a lot. I mean, I might add some when I put a new gasket on. Just a little bit extra because these, especially if the oil pan is being way tighter, now it's going to be warped up and then it's still going to have some kind of a leak. So. Uh, I will just add a little bit of the RTV, just just a little bit, because this is kind of too much that they put. This is definitely too much RTV. Look at that. It's way too much. I'm gonna clean this pickup screen as well. Alright guys, it's the next morning. I'm going to be getting ready right now to reinstall the oil pan and gasket and uh, I already cleaned up the oil pan and uh, painted it so I'll show it to you in a little bit and yeah, I've got a new gasket for it and uh, I will just add a little bit of RTV sealant. I'll show you where exactly I'm going to put it and we're going to let it cure and tomorrow probably when the cure is fully we're going to you know, start adding oil and all the other stuff. Got a new gasket going on. So we're adding just a little bit around, not too much. 
Okay, and then I'm only putting it on the oil pan, on the small one. Make sure the surface is all clean. Let's put the maintenance mating surface especially. And you're ready to install the pan. Finally, after all the bolts are reinstalled, uh, I'm about to install brand new uh, drain plug. And then we're gonna let it sit for at least 24 hours so that our TV can cure. I mean, you can see it's not coming out of the crevices or anything. I mean, you can kind of see it right there, but I didn't put a lot, you know, I put some. I um, mean, hopefully it's gonna take care of pretty much all the leaks, but who knows, might still leak, might have still like a small seepage, hopefully not, but you know, we'll see what happens. Hopefully, hopefully she's, she's good. But first I need to make sure that this everything cures right there on the RTV. All right guys, this is the next day. Uh, the oil pan is all, is all dried up right now. And I'm about to start putting oil in this baby. Um, and then I'll also replace the filter. Uh, so let's go ahead and pour this oil in uh, real quick. Okay. And uh, let me show you this oil pan really quick. It's beautiful, uh, looking really nice, uh, very clean. Okay, so we're gonna put this oil in right now and we're gonna see how she's doing afterwards and then also the oil filter. 